Good evening, I'm Stan Boney. I'm Mandy Noel. A proposed law in Poland has people mad and lawyers from Columbus coming to the village hall meeting tonight. The law would regulate the number of group homes allowed in one neighborhood. 27 First News reporter Noah Daniels Wilder heard from both sides. He's live in the newsroom with our top story at 11. Yes, it would be a while before the law is even voted on, but if it does pass, it could cause people to leave the comforts of their own home. You're trying to exclude a certain population and we're not going to stand for it. Holding his ground, Chris Maruka defends his daughter who has a disability. This is nothing but an ordinance to try to exclude a certain population. Sam Moffey of Poland Village Council proposed a law that wouldn't allow group homes to be within 500 feet of each other. We don't want a group home after group home after group home opening up in the community. Moffey started the idea because of the two group homes in Poland that house people with disabilities. I'm trying to understand why it is that I would not want a disabled person to live next to another disabled person that, so that they can have the same sense of community that we all have. Mofi believes group homes takes down property values of other houses. I do because it's in a residential area. If it was in a zoned area for group homes, medical businesses, no, it wouldn't. My clients are not doing harm to anyone by living here. Shirsten Schoberg is an attorney for Disability Rights Ohio. She believes this law could be illegal. The ordinance definitely uh, raises serious concerns with the Fair Housing Act. An act that doesn't allow you to discriminate someone from living in a neighborhood based on their race, sex, national origin, or disability. One of the things I don't like specifically about the fair housing hiding behind it is it stops us from being able to do electrical inspection, fire inspection. Schoberg says her clients live just like any other neighbors. They go to work. They have providers that come in and help them. They pay rent. All the things that we do uh, to enjoy our lives, my clients do those same things. Mofi doesn't have a problem with the group homes in Poland. He just wants them to be more spread out. So we're not saying you can't have them, but I don't, we don't want them one on top of another in area, especially in a residential area. I did go door to door talking to neighbors to see how they felt about a group home being right across or right next to where they live. They said as long as they keep up the house and make sure that the yard is clean, they don't have a problem with it. Live in the newsroom, Noah Daniels, Water WKBN 27, First News at 11.